Hey, welcome everyone, I'm Minikako, and welcome back to Bug Fables and the Everlasting Sapling. Last episode we reached the Golden Hill stop. I don't really know what this area is called, but we also finished it and we already need to go here, which I imagine is the final boss of the chapter 2. Uh, some news, I kind of went to sleep at 4 a.m. yesterday again, so it's late again. Uh, that also means I didn't have time to voice train again. <laughs> I'm sorry. So voice acting, not gonna improve today. Sorry. And I guess without further ado, let's just get into the boss or whatever it is. Yeah, this is... The artifact and the final boss. Just as expected, the artifact is here. Somewhere. You yeah, sure? I mean, it's just flowers all around us. Flowers. That's it. One of these flowers must be the artifact. Uh, probably not. Only one way to find out. Start cutting, Cabo. Uh, what? That's enough. By the gods, it's Venus. It's Venus herself. <laughs> Indeed, the one and only. I've been keeping my ear on you, my precious bugs. It was really, really hoping all the bridges and monsters will stop you. I'm so stubborn, and now you'd even trample on my garden. My precious garden. It, it was just a joke, okay? We just need the artifact. To line your pockets. <laughs> You care more for an artifact than your blue friend here. There. Washed up from a river, yet you worried more about material thing than your own companion? But what? How did you? My roots travel on across the soil. Sometimes I catch some gossip. Incredible. This is truly the feat of a higher being. <laughs> Though I must say, Cabo, I am beyond pleased with your worship. Please, I am not worthy. You're so chivalrous and kind, so why won't you share your burdens with your friends? Venus, please, say no more. What's your deal? Is nagging people like got a job? You know everything then. What bothers by Gabo knows? Well, not everything, but I can certainly know more than you do. <laughs> then, what about us? Why are we still here after so many years? You, you're all way different than your average bug. Greed, sadness, purpose, such diverse motives within your team. Please tell us. Bye, Cabo, lies, the artifact and all your questions you want to ask. If you get through my special trial, they are all yours. Bring it on, we will have our answers. <laughs> well said, it's artifact time. Venus, despite everything, I will face your trial with honor. <laughs> Get ready. <laughs> what in the shining crown of the queens is that? That's way bigger than the spider! Get ready, you two. We are getting what we came for. Okay. It's boss time. To be challenged by the goddess, am I really worthy? No matter, I will cut through his defenses for the artifact and for life. Okay, let's just test out the waters. Cause this battle is gonna be something else. Oh, are you ready for this? Not really. Okay, life. <laughs> this is going to be a lot of fucking damage. Oops. 
7 damage. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, just just free the coffin again. Use heavy strike. Okay. And just use a regular attack. Huh, you're stronger than you look. But have you ever seen something like this? Wings? What is doing the healing uh, effect? I don't know, but I don't have time for that, so... <laughs> You're still in the air? <laughs> okay, no, uh, piece of... Legit coffin, fuck you. No attack for you, buddy. Uh, I don't. I'm not gonna use Pi for this. I'm gonna use Kabu for this. Hear me out. I'm gonna use Kabu for this. I'm gonna use Vi. I'm gonna use the. Uh... Does this guy? It doesn't have defense. So I'm just gonna use Tornado Toss. And I'm gonna use Frigid Coffin again. And I'm gonna fucking attack him. There we go! Hi! Oh, that was easy. Ah, uh, but nowadays have become quite strong. It is our honor to hear so open us. Now, if you'd answer on us. And hand over the artifact. Fine, fine, I really owe you anyways. Other than Arya, it's been years since I saw another bug. It's been so refreshing. Hmm? Were your roots not all across Bulgari? Well, my bots don't really have eyes, so I can only sense things with them, you see? Oh, you didn't see what happened to us in Snake Mode then. Tell me more, you curious thing. Back when I in the first room, our team was on a scouting mission to Snake Mode. We fell under, and a spider trapped us. We went to sleep and woke up when Vi and Cabo saved us. So many moons later. That was quite a while back, let me try and remember. Yes, a team of three. One of them falls, the other two flee with our lives. They... lived? The remaining one lingers, yet the presence vanishes. What? It just vanishes? Um, I don't recall feeling that presence since. Even now, I cannot sense life's presence. Although I see you here, I'm sorry, but that's all I can tell you. Venus, thank you. Knowing that our team was safe brought us so much peace. Hey, <laughs> ain't that goddess for nothing? We are ever closer to the truth, life. Yep, awesome! No questions from you, Cabo? Thank you, Venus, but don't worry, I am managing quite well. If anyone's fine on the team, it's Cabo. <laughs> I'll respect your wishes on this. Anyways, uh, that just leaves. I know, I know, the artifact, honestly, just agree to me, doesn't deserve it. Be grateful for your teammates. But anyways, here you go.
You have found the art, the ancient tablet. Do you think we can say na ah to the queen again? <laughs> Seems Nick Mouth ventured into the Golden Settlement in search of another hidden artifact and answers about life's slumber. After the festival of joy, friendship, and bonding, the path to the sacred hills opened for them. Filled with determination, <laughs> they gathered the pieces to, to reach its highest point and fought off sass and motive along the way. Now that they've earned the goddess's approval and artifact, they go the way to the everlasting sapling, finally within BBC in reach. End of chapter 2. Mission super complete! We should go report back then. That tablet is important to find the everlasting sapling that the queen is searching for. I do not know how it works, but it should hold clues on how to locate it. Thank you, Venus. How can we ever repay you? Hmm. Just promise to visit me sometime, alright? Bring Aria if you can. <laughs> oh, and don't tell others about me, of course. Stay safe and remember, I am always watching over you. Come visit me sometime in the future. <laughs> But as Venus is so nice to so for someone of her status. No kidding. A license the second could learn a bit from her. Maybe we should bring the queen to visit. That would probably be difficult, I'd imagine. And we are not willing to put in the extra effort to make it happen. Oh. Oh yes, time to walk all the way back. I don't understand that mechanic. Why cannot why what why can't we reign HP to the crystals now. We have to pay the fucking stay at the inns. Hey, Team Snake Mouth! Sorry, that's not Celia's voice. Whatever. Ugh, we drank too much juice last night. We couldn't get moving. We couldn't even watch the last ceremony, but we heard you made it into the hills. I assume you found the artifact? That's right. It's so jealous. That's too important artifact six nights from anyone else. Probably we did that something like that. Great job, we should head back to the Ant Kingdom at once. At the end, the Queen will be very pleased. <laughs> we are doing great. Come on now, bye. Let's go to the Ant Kingdom. We will go ahead to notify the Queen and prepare the onions. If you don't want to walk all the way back, we should go to the Ant Tunnels. There should be one just outside the settlement. I don't need the King waiting. You met Venus, didn't you? She sent me a request to keep the Golden Hill Centrals open for you. She must have done very well to receive her approval. <laughs> you're so sad now. Wait, no, you're a different person. I heard Matiba was here, but it seems I miss her. I wonder where her next show will be. The show is finally over, but you're still free to hang out. If you are here for the quest, check out the board near the counter. Okay, so the tunnels apparently are the mines. Well, that boss fight was like fairly easy, all things considered. Uh, but I think that's... You're a new guy? Goo goo goo. I am Music Caravan's little friend, and for all though, I'm gonna keep the business going. Try to find my sleep on. Just mixing a spicy bomb with a thumbnail dart. That's such a great result. Sorry, Berries, you're a... Mm, no. Ah, uh, yeah, that wasn't easy. An easy boss fight, but I think that's mostly because this stupid attack is a stupid attack. Rigid Coffin is just overpowered as fuck, and it costs 3 TP. If this thing costed like 5 TP, maybe, but costing 3 is so stupid overpowered. The hurricane does cost 5. This costing 3 is like... No. I think I should just limit myself in using it because... If I keep spamming it in every boss, uh, there's absolutely zero challenge. Like, you saw how I steamroll through Mothima? I Mothima attacked literally a single time during her boss fight. A single time. 
And it was because I used my turn to spy. Massive attack one time, and that's it. And I also steamrolled through this boss thanks to Frigid Coffin. Yeah, like, it, it's so fucking stupidly overpowered, that attack. It's insane. But yeah, I think I should just not use Frigid Coffin because... It, it, it just... It's just so overpowered that it absolutely fucking trivializes bosses. I don't know, let me know what you think. Should I still use it because... I don't know. I, I li enemies literally do not attack, and it makes bosses n not encounters pretty much. Oh no, Maki's still not back, <laughs> and we have to meet the queen. Huh. Yeah, let me know what you think in the comments because yeah, it it makes bosses pretty much cutscenes, and uh, I don't know. I don't think that's really fun. But anyway, let's continue. It's one thing to make the queen wait, but us as well? Oh, you're here. Come on now, the queen's waiting for us. Oh, you're welcome, I must say. You're just in time. It's really crowded. Those questions will have to wait. Hello, sweetheart, for the ado. Team Snake Mouth. Have you found the artifact hidden in the Holden Hills? Yep, we're ready for that reward. Wonderful! This timing is simply impeccable. I must congratulate you for bringing this artifact to my care. This must be a sign of even more good things to come for the End Kingdom and Bulgaria. It was our honor, your highness. Sergeant, please collect the artifact and hand them the rewards. That's your command, my queen. You have earned this, Team Snake Mouth. You are a crystal Mary. I'm sorry, that's fucking good. Uh, hehe, <laughs> thanks again. The buy bank keeps spinning. That's the name. Oh. Oh, mm, may I take a look as we discuss? Yes, make haste, Tariant. Handle it with care, Professor. Of course. Yes, yes, my research held through. This tablet must contain information on how to find an everlasting sapling. What? But that's just a bunch of blue lines. Oh, oh boy, that's where the math is you found it name all comes in. It really was a mask? I thought it was just a weird rock. Ah, huh, so I was right. I'm boss cabo. And now, the mass is an interpreter. Though, it this line morph into the Rauch alphabet. I cannot tell how it actually works. But the Rauches has such a marvelous technology. I'm smitten. Wonderful! How very wonderful! We are making progress in finding the sapling. Finally! So what do you need the everlasting sapling for? That is not for you to know. Just know that with it my mother's dream will come true to last. License dream? Professor, how long will it take for you to decipher this tablet? Um, um it will take some time. Even with the mask, the rooms are still in the touch script, certainly. I see. Red not. That leaves us with time to retrieve the other artifact. There's another one? My research indicates there are three artifacts. With the missing key, we can unlock the Everlasting Sapling. Then we're almost at the finish line. Yes, and given what we know, the key should be in the big kingdom. Really? Long ago, before knowing of its real nature, the, the key used they use it when building the honey factory before. But I'm not sure if they will give it up because taking it out will shut down the whole thing. It shut down the factory. It shut down the factory. I, I cannot pronounce the T now. <laughs> it shut down the factory, but. Do not worry, but of you. 
We have sent our envoys to the big kingdom ever since you told us about the key. Finally, they have agreed to let us take it in exchange for materials to be the replacement. That is wonderful. Oh joy, I need one cause and many trouble. So the Joe's trading these materials for the artifact? Precisely, that is your next mission. And luckily, the young bee joined your ranks recently. He will be of great help in this mission. Oh, right. These teams need money on the roll, aren't they? And it's all for games, so yeah. We have our own dash to excel that. With that, you are all dismissed. Except Team Zaymod and Team Celia. I wish to have a word with you. Well, guess we'll be going now. Now, I kept you here to ask about the worst situation. The professor has mentioned you all helped him when he was attacked. For that, you have my gratitude. We are unworthy, your highness. We only did what an explorer ought to. Oh, cool. I was worried, though. They seem to know about the artifact somehow. Then, it is as I feared. We are running out of time. You must all remain on guard and avoid the northern border with the West Kingdom at all costs. As you wish, your highness. To reach the big kingdom, you must travel southeast, southeast from the association and take the first north exit. With my permission, explorers may now cross the passage to the Lost Sands. Be wary, however, the number of mandis in the Lost Sands has been increasing lately. Head straight to the Defiant Route as soon as possible to enter the Beehive. We will get it done, your highness. Dismissed. Chapter 3. Factory Inspection. Okay, so... This game might be a lot shorter than I thought. That being said, we do have some things to take care of first. Damn. If you have time, perhaps you could check out Quest for the Plaza? Yes. Try not to clear the mission so quickly, so we may catch up. No promises. Okay, so little, little cut and pause for a moment. Uh, I had the the impression that this game will, would follow the Paper Mario formula. You know, being divided into seven chapters. Uh, is the game really gonna be divided into four chapters? Because that's the impression I'm getting. Well, no, because there's this whole last map over here. Are we really not gonna explore all of this area? Because like, there's a big kingdom here, there's the Lost Sands here, but there's also this fucking huge ass area over there. And like, come on, there's an emblem here, but there's also these. This game has to be divided into seven chapters, right? There's no way that it's just chapter four, the everlasting sapling, and it fucking ends there. Right? <laughs> There's like no way. I mean, I have to assume it's our best hearing telling me like, Oh, we are near the finish line. I have- if I have to guess... Okay. You know what would be actually pretty cool? Well, kinda cool. Not Maybe not pretty cool, but like... Imagine if we get the... And please don't spoil me. Please do not spoil me, because I actually do care about this story. But imagine if we get the Everlasting Sapling in Chapter 4 and we give it to Eliza in the second and somehow the the story doesn't end and like Eliza like rises to power or something and then Eliza rises to power and something fucked up happens and the next three chapters is trying to undo that whole thing That would be kinda, kinda cool But anyway Cabo, life, bye Thank you, I'll stay here under my part I hope it would be smooth sailing for you, having Vi and your team. Must be a big help. Ah, uh, yeah, definitely. The surround room has not changed, but the atmosphere is completely different. What do you mean? It's a bit somber. They've covered some of the other queens too. Megarius' history isn't perfect. It's a shame that there have been issues between the kingdoms. That'd be weird, going from full peace for them nowadays. History can't prove cruel. I've never been to the hype. This is a good opportunity. 
Uh huh. Fine, are you okay? I know you're not on the best terms, but. Look, I don't wanna talk about it right now, okay? Uh. Well, if you don't wanna talk about it, there's something we want to discuss. What's up? We just mentioned that our. Our team got away from Snake Mouse Steps. Even in the passage of time, they're most likely gone, but. We can't help but think. Maybe their children are around. Do you follow? Oh, oh, that's right! Your team can be around in spirit. Life, you'd like to go look for them? We're in the middle of a mission, so there's no rush, but if we ever find the time. No problem, we'll just find them as we go along. Indeed, we'll keep our eyes open. Thank you, that's... that's all. Let's get on the mission. Alright, uh, yeah, let, let's go. Oh dear. Well, I still got no godforsaken clue where the goddamn tunnels are. You got more missions? God damn. Okay. <laughs> okay, uh. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> stupid. Remember when those guys were like an absolute fucking menace? Why is there a rock here? <laughs> okay, that's kinda cool. I'm sorry about that that sound that I made, it probably absolutely destroyed the audio a bit, right? But I don't have enough to put this on, and I don't kinda I don't really need it. Okay, that was a cool secret to find, but kind of irrelevant in the end. Do you guys sell new? Yeah, you do. Ooh. Poisoning powers, wise needle skills? What the fuck is a needle skill? I don't know, but I don't have needle skills. What? Whoops. Dot, dot. Come on. It's lunchtime. Aw, oh, mom. Can I play a bit longer? Sweetie, you need to eat. Well, it'll give you all the power you need to play all day. I made you your favorite, a tasty hearty breakfast. Wow, well, thanks, Mom. Life, who is Mios? That's our wife. Your wife? But life, that's impossible. And she's got to be your super mega granddaughter. That's Right, isn't it great? You can meet up with your relatives. No, not at all. How can we face them like this? Lots of time not even understanding ourselves? Can't be that bad. To them, we are just a stranger. We're going to intrude in their life. We need to know the truth about what happened to us. We will help you, life. Every step in the, of this journey. Uh, yeah, and when you're ready, you can come back and meet them. Thanks. Let's keep an eye out for this. We can't ignore our vision. Now let's keep going. Even so, we're glad to see them safe and happy. They just fucking despawn? Hmm. Not yet, we're not ready to face them. Very well, let's come back once we learn what happened in the Snake Mountain. Okay, well, uh, that's gonna do it for this episode. I can't kinda sidetrack. I don't really know what I was doing. <laughs> for the last, like, 15 minutes. <laughs> But yeah, next episode, I'm gonna warn you, it's gonna be a bit filler. I'm gonna turn to these side quests. At least the ones that I know how to do because I still have no fucking clue what the tunnels are or how to do the side quests that require me to do shit around the tunnels. <laughs> I'm... I don't know. <laughs> but uh, the ones that I can do, I'm gonna do. So yeah, next episode, a bit filler. But if you care about the side quests, Tune in for next episode, otherwise check in in like 4 days for the actual chapter 3 stuff. And yeah, if you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to do the usual, like, comment, subscribe and follow for more. And I'll be seeing you on the next one. Bye bye!